Hey, what's up? So we're gonna do a 90 second video today. We're gonna be talking about, well, we're gonna be talking about my, my, can we start that again? So today we're gonna do 90 seconds of life advice for creatives. Recently, I transitioned from being a full-time chef to trying to be a full-time creative. I'm worried about making rent, I'm worried about being judged by my peers, and it's pretty rough mentally. It... I'm feeling pretty good right now, so let's talk through them. Well, Pat, first one. I don't have enough money to make rent. If you don't have enough money to make rent, you have all the options at your disposal. Double down on whatever creative options you have to earn money. So teach, beg someone for a gig, make your own gig, sell a sample pack, do whatever you need to do, sell your artwork, just put it out there, go back to the job you were at, maybe just work and then work harder in the times where you're not at work. It's like detaching your ego from making money off your music straight away. Um, I'm also worried, Pat, about looking after the people that I love. People that you love will understand that you have creative passions and you wanna go hard for them and the people that you love are fully capable of looking after themselves. You want into, you want two independent people to love each other. I'm worried that people are gonna judge me. That's an insecurity thing. I feel like what you need to do is double down on the things that you love, find people that love the things that you love, and just make more art the way that you love to make art. I feel like you're kind of telling me to spend more time doing and spend less time stressing. Mm -hmm. We all have the same 24 hours. For me, I think the, ma the biggest issue with people on the creative endeavor is literally self-motivation. There are no handouts that has to come from you. So work hard for your creative freedom. When it does pay off, you'll really be truly grateful for it.